Alright, we're back. Uh, so are you guys just Eleanor's vlog? Yeah. yeah. It's, kind of, it's kind of weird that we sat here and watched her drop a log. I mean, I, I was into it. Jessica was kind of creeped out the whole time, but, uh, um, what was it saying? Oh, yeah, yeah, apparently she's a barbarian, and, uh, uh, everyone but her is actually sad because, well, they only think they're happy because they're stupid. Um, basically, Dr. Lamb doesn't like the, the lower 99%. Yeah. She, she, she's one of the upper 100. And she's also a bitch. Empty house. Only an echo to my name. Eleanor. Baby, where are you? turned my back and someone took you. It happened so quick. I'm not even a half mama to you, girl. I couldn't protect you. This poster of Dr. Lamb in my room is staring me down like it knows I'm ashamed. I've always been loyal to your real mother, Eleanor. Always trusted her with my secrets. But I lost you. What will the doctor think of me now? Well, as long as you keep that big black lady dick, I'm sure she'll think of you just fine. Although, obviously not in public, because that sort of thing is frowned upon. You know, interracial couples back then? Yeah. Uh, actually, actually, I got a 50s joke, eh? Well, it's not really 50s, it's basically anyone... Anywhere between the 18th and the 50s. So, so an interracial couple walks to a bar, and they aren't immediately lynched. You get it? It's funny, because they would be lynched. Go on, take it. I won't have you touching me. Dr. Lamb trusted me to care for her child. And I tried. The baby Eleanor disappeared. And then one day, I see her walking with you. Looking wrong. Mosquito. And when mm -hmm. I tried to hold her, you knocked me down. Broke my jaw. So I'm ready, baby snatcher. Come on in and finish the job. Look, lady, I don't want to touch you either. I don't care if you I don't care what Dr. Lamb does to you, your big black lady. Dick. I'm not touching you. Your call, friend. Gracie's unarmed, for what it's worth. Oh, that's true. Actually, now that I think about it, how long ago did I break her jaw? Her face looks still looks a little swollen. I can pull the trigger right now. Don't. Oh, come on, I can blow her black face straight to hell. No. Or, or her black doing? lady did. Come on, you goddamn monster. Do what you always do. Come on! I am. I'm stealing your stuff as fast as I can. I don't even know there was shit in here. The override key is right there, son. Whatever you do to grace it, don't forget why we're here. Yeah, shut up, you old whore. To hell with you, then. Go on. Fine, don't You're murder me. You're a bigger me. man than I am, Chief. Maybe next time she'll think twice about pointing fingers before all the facts are in. Now, let's be on our way. Eleanor's waiting. Maybe she'll think about pointing a big black lady dick. You had me under a gun? Yet you just walk away. No monster alive turns the other cheek. No monster does that. A thinking man does that. Lady, I'm not turning any of my cheeks to you and your big black lady did. I know that Dr. Lamb is no liar, but she's got to be wrong about you. Doesn't seem right now, letting you walk into that bushwhack waiting outside. I can't call off the family, but I can whisper a bit... And improve your odds. Girl, don't you go whispering to me. These whirly birds are a custom job by an old friend. I'm afraid this is all I can do for now. Why'd you power him down? I don't want to check him out. No, no. Go away. You go away. Well, I can't pick him up. Oh, that's fine. Get it, deactivate him? Yep. Alright, let's go. Time to run off and do a great big bushwhack. Which, by the way, is what she calls her vagina. You know, the one under her big black lady there. Who 
watch your goddamn bullets, ho. Undefeatable. Well, I gotta say, she was right. That was a hell of a bushwalk. I don't think I would have survived that if they didn't fire maybe two bullets. Oh. Take a nap, bitch. Take a double nap, bitch. Seriously, have they actually hit an enemy yet? I don't think they have. on that one. Well, sir, I don't know what to call you now. You've done more than just spare my life. You've opened my eyes. I need to put a few questions to Dr. Lamb. And by questions, I mean my big black lady did. Well, putting a few of her big black lady dick to someone doesn't make much sense. Dead bubbles. By sparing grace, do you seek to gain my trust? A feeble ruse. Your crocodile tears may poison her with doubt, but I am not so easy a mark. No, you're just dumb bitch one percenter. The next hand. Just take that override key and slot it into the control box in the ticket booth there. That'll open the gates. If you know what I mean. Yeah, so next we're heading to Apparently, Dionysus Park, Fontaine Futuristics, and then the unknown land of unknown things that are unknown. Ooh, unknown. Unknown. Hop on, kid, and start the train. Don't make me pull the whistle now. Don't you go friggin' doing the wolf whistle call to me, you some bitch. All right, gonna overwrite the save. Look at that saving. Saving like a motherfucker. Motherfucker saving motherfucker. Grr. God, I hate it when it takes long time to save. Yeah. Yes, you want, yes, you want to do Skyrim videos? That'll freaking uh, put us on the YouTube for a couple thousand hours. Doing a full playthrough of Skyrim. How can you not really like Skyrim? Skyrim's like a $10 hole. Just keeps going and going. Oh, that's weird. Grab my mouse. Son of a bitch, how the hell is this thing dead? When I get back to the farm, I'm much too tired to fuck my uncle. A cool. Oh, hear that? You can bang her for a dime a throw. Oh, just waiting for Jessica. She'll be back in a second. Jessica, you only have a second left. Go, go, go. Hurry up. Quiet, you. Anyways, back to the game. Sorry about that. Some bitch, I was saving its goddamn content. So much for comedic timing. Yeah. Is that wrong if this reminds me of the time I was a spam? Hear me, O oh ye who would murder the Lamb of God. Ye shall never reach her God. And by God it I mean her vagina.
damn, this got blown by a by an Irishman. Wish I could say that never happened to me. Why, Father McKay? Why? Uh, Father McKay. Kid, come on, wake up now. There you are. I thought you rode that torpedo into the great hereafter. I'm in Dionysus Park now. Train cars are shambles, leaking air. Whole damn place is flooded and sealed. But there's a pumping station back there on Siren Alley, and I believe you could jerry-rig it to drain the park out. That'd let you stroll right inside. Get to those pumps and hurry. Huh. Adam slugs. All right, so I guess we're not going to Dionysus Park yet. We have to go to, uh... Siren Alley. To the Siren Alley. I see Father Wales has parted you from your craft. And yet, you cling to life. Congratulations. Today, Delta, you meet a man who has no fear of death. And for Eleanor, he would burn with a smile. Sister, that's how great at sex that little girl is. He's just like, oh, it burns, but it's so worth it. Oh. Alright, I'm gonna rock the gas bomb, blow some mine. Oh, dumb broad. Well, that's why they call me the rivet gun sniper. Also, the handgun sniper, the machine gun sniper. I'm just, I'm just really good sniping. Good at sniping. Sniping good at. I fire guns accurately. Often into people's heads. Alright, what's the ammo bandito got? Alright, got some, uh, got some shoot bangs ready now. Wow, and not a fuck was given. There we go. Now not a fucking shit. Ah, oh, shit. What that's called to say? Now, what's that say? It which we are all saved. Okay, apparently get that needle jammed in your uh, jammed in your urethra is uh, what saves people nowadays. No, they used to have holy water and crosses, but uh, no, that's the holy symbol now. You just jam it right in your dick hole. Then you jam it in your vagina. Imagine if you're, you're, uh, your urethra was big enough to ship hot dogs in. Fuck. Uh, Imagine how big your dick would be. I don't know, maybe not big, but ruined. That would be fucking bad. <laughs> just, just complete urethral destruction. You, you, you know, you know, people often make like ruined vagina jokes when they talk about like guys with massive dicks. God damn, that would be bad. Death of the family. Mother of mercy, I think that was Simon Wales. What's he done to himself? He and his brother were Rapture's architects, but when Doc Lamb came along, Simon got religion. All right. Well, uh, I think religion's where we're going to cut it. See you later.